What's up everyone, this is Ryan with UniqueApps.com. Today's app review is going to cover the premium application Days of Thunder. Days of Thunder is a NASCAR um, racing game. It's actually a very fun game, lots of gameplay, um, lots of different levels and, and just different things you can do, different features and I'm actually going to go through, I'm going to start the um, turn. pretty good soundtrack on it too. I'm going to um, start a circuit, a brand new circuit, so you can just see the walkthrough of how, how it goes. Here's the main vent. Again, really good graphics here. Um, you have select a cir circuit, select a track that you can just race on any track once you unlock them. Options, there's only a couple options. Turning, oops, I selected the wrong, I selected achievements. Options, really the only options are music and sound effects. Um, Select a car again once you unlock all the car and then the credits. We're just going to go through, I'm going to start a brand new um, circuit and just show you um, really uh, what happens. You have uh, you have your crew chief um, and um, here's obviously you right here and here's your crew chief. He's talking to you. So there is a little bit of a story mode here um, that gives you up. And again, I'm not going to go through the story mode. I'm actually just going to skip in here and let you play it does take a little while to load this game, but again, this game is very feature-rich. The graphics are great. Um, there's a lot of good things, so so the loading times on this game is a little while. But um, other than that, it's a great game. So once it starts here, um, it'll show you your rival right here. This is the guy. You get extra points if you actually take out your rival. And this they're actually pretty ruthless in this game. I mean, they'll slam you and pin you into the grass and stuff like this. So, um, so here it is. Um, here's your pit chief talking to you. And again, you won't have to do this every race, but I'm starting a new one so you can see all these different features. Car's health is at the top right, so here's the health right here. Once you get hit, um, when you get hit or slammed or something like that, your health will actually decrease. Um, and you can actually take a pit stop to, to um, recharge your health. And here, that's where it says when you're near the lap market, you can hit the pit by hitting this button right here. And don't take this pit all the, all the time. These should be used wisely, so you shouldn't pit every single lap. Um, your crew chief will come and tell you, hey, your tires are getting getting worn out. You need a pit, and once you see this button, take it. But I made the mistake when I first started to pit at, at just whenever, and I lost the race because you shouldn't pit all the time. So hit that. Um, here's the hammer, too. As you draft cars, the meter will build up. Um, so this... The more you draft behind, just like in NASCAR, the more this meter builds up, and then once that fills up, it'll give you a hammer. And you tap that button, it, calls tap, it says tap that button to drop the hammer. Once you do that, your car just like speeds ahead, um, and I think you're invincible for like three seconds or something. So it says, so now get out there um, and go. So again, I'm, I apologize if anybody's watching this, if anybody gets a little sick, because I'm looking through a camera while I'm playing this. So, um, Here's the game. Another thing, um, let me pause this real quick. Another thing to notice, um, your gas pedal and your brake pedal, make sure that you're pressing that at all times because I noticed that when I was first playing this, my thumb was sliding to the left over here and my car was just going really slow and I was barely touching the accelerator. So really the only thing I can say is when you're playing this game, make sure you're really holding on that accelerator right here in the right hand corner because if you're if your finger slides off here a little bit, you'll you'll your car will slow down and people start passing you. So, we we'll go ahead and resume. Uses the accelerometer, um, and now, oh, see I'm slamming people. Watch, they'll run me off the road here. <laughs> so they get pretty. Um, <laughs> it's like a game of bumper cars almost. Whoa. Oh, see, my my thumb was actually um, off the accelerator there. That's why that's why everybody's passing me, and that's what I was talking to you. So I can use this hammer here, and see the hammer kind of just makes you speed up. It's a little bit cheating. Um, I don't think they really need that hammer in there, but I just use it. If you draft enough, you get to use it. So now I'm out ahead. Um, good good use of the accelerometer. I think it's kind of computer guided though a little bit. It's not like you can. The accelerometer is a little bit forgiving, so it kind of um, it kind of auto corrects almost. So you're still using it, but you see, you can see whenever I go in a turn, the the car actually adjusts 
Um, watch, watch when I go in the turn. The car will actually adjust a little bit. So the computer is actually helping the accelerometer. Um, did you see it kind of turn a little bit? And there's everybody slamming. Okay, see the the guy's telling me I need a pit now. So once I see this pit button, um, hope I don't. There you go. So now I'm in the pit. My position is going. Um, here's my health going up now. And as soon as your health reaches the top, you take off. So you hit resume. Um, now I'm back on the lap. I'm I'm in position seven of eight, but um, we can make that up that time because all the other guys have to pit too. So again, that's really all the gameplay. I probably won't finish this race, or I'll, I'll just finish this race real quick and show you. Um, if you want to keep watching it, great. If not, go ahead and pause the video, or go ahead and turn this video off now. But I'm going to go ahead and finish this race. And um, again, I apologize if anybody's getting sick while watching. The oh. <laughs> If anybody's getting sick while watching this, like I said, I'm trying to play this while looking through a video camera, so it's a little bit harder. Um, I'm in position three out of eight, and hopefully I'll be able to. This is lap, whoa, lap five. So it looks like I'll probably finish second, hopefully. Or maybe first. Oh. <laughs> Alright, first place. Cool, just barely. Anyway. That's um, the review of Days of Thunder. It gives me some achievements there after the first thing. Um, let me go ahead and show you. Track unlocked. Again, the graphics are really neat here too. Um, well, I'm not going to show you all that. That's a review of Days of Thunder. Great great game. Um, 99 cent game, I think. Actually, let me look real quick. Yeah, for a dollar, definitely great game. Tons of entertainment. Lots of levels. Lots of tracks. Lots of cars. And um, pretty good graphics, as you saw. I give it a 4 out of 5 stars. And um, fun game. Again, this is Ryan with UniqueApps.com. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you did enjoy the review, um, please subscribe to my YouTube channel for future reviews and updates. So, hope you all have a great day, and I look forward to shooting the next review for you guys and girls. Have a good one.